Something disabled seven satellites in Earth orbit. A UFO attack, or is this a new type of space technology? This happened uh, basically last year after the Russia-Ukraine operation, about, about a month later. Weeks ago, became known for an unexplained reason. In December 2021, January 2022, seven satellites stopped working in Earth orbit. Moreover, they belong to the United States. So all these were U.S. satellites. Official representatives did not comment on these incidents, suggesting only that a simple breakdown could have occurred immediately on seven autonomous satellites. Oh, so that's a little bit uh, coincidental, isn't it? This is what was reported, but do you believe in coincidence? Well, I don't. This situation seems to be hushed up when suddenly an Australian amateur astronomer reported on his blog that what he saw, how an oblong UFO released several reddish balls towards the satellites. When they reached the goals, they simply crumbled. And from his words, it turned out that something attacked earthly artificial satellites. This is again from an uh, uh, Australian amateur astronomer. After this sensational statement, he was invited to a local radio station where he said that the object flew up to the satellites as if they were standing still, although the average speed of each such device is about 28,500 kilometers an hour. So it's faster than an asteroid. Now, based on these data, the amateur astronomer suggested that this UFO was moving at a speed of more than 100,000 kilometers an hour. NASA did not immediately respond to a request from several ufologists and astronomers. However, in February, an official spokesman said that all these reports have nothing to do with reality and that all satellites controlled by NASA are operating normally. However, the Australian was not the only one who noticed strange activity in space. A 24-year-old Japanese ufologist saw a similar incident through his telescope on January 19, after which he published a written report on the observations. Strikingly accurately, the details of this story repeated what the Australian amateur astronomer saw as well. Is someone or something attacking Earth satellites in our orbit? Or are the world's two major superpowers quietly testing space weapons and technology? Then how did they manage to reach speeds of up to 100,000 kilometers an hour? Most likely unknown forces took part in this incident. Is that probable? Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. This is on Solask. Thank you. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box.